Located in the northeastern corner of Africa, Egypt is a country that is long known for its ancient civilization. It is considered to be the oldest travel destination on Earth that offers unusual experiences for all types of travelers worldwide. Egypt is famous for its fascinating temples, tombs, pyramids, pharaohs, and mummies. If you are planning to visit this country, the best time of the year would be from the month of October to April, as the weather and temperature would be suitable for you to explore. Here are the 10 amazing places to visit in Egypt. But before we start, please subscribe so you won't miss our latest amazing travel video. Number 1 on our list is White Desert. This desert covers more than 2.8 million square kilometers that starts at the western banks of the Nile to Libya. It would be an ultimate playground for adventurers who love to travel in deserts. The strange ghost white rock formations are created as a result of several sandstorms that happen in the place. This creates a bizarre scene that seems to be icebergs that are stranded in the sand. Taking a four-wheel drive through the desert will give you a surreal once-in-a-lifetime experience. You can also stay here for overnight camping. Number 2. Mount Sinai The next popular attraction has a huge significance in religion, as it was mentioned several times in the Bible, Quran, and Book of Exodus. It is where Moses received the Ten Commandments. The popular activity in this attraction is hiking, especially through the night. You can also stay in a lodge and watch the sunrise on the mountain. Just below Mount Sinai is the world's oldest working monastery, the St. Catherine's Monastery. It has a UNESCO World Heritage Site status. And if you visit here, take a look at the preserved hand of the real St. Catherine. Number 3. Nile River Cruising is the best way to explore Egypt's spectacular river, the Nile River. It is the most relaxing way to see the interesting flora and fauna that fills the Nile, to have a great view of the rural parts of the country, and to visit the temples that stood the banks of the river. Big cruises stop at the Temple of Komombo and Edfu's Temple of Horus. You can also cruise the river by Egypt's traditional Latin-sailed wooden boats called Filuka. It is preferable if you want a slower experience that is less crowded. Another good thing is that you can create your own itinerary by riding this. However, if riding boats are not your thing, you can just watch the sunset at the banks of Aswan. Number 4. Siwa Oasis This little oasis, located near the western border of Egypt, is a top spot to unwind for a few days. Until late in the 19th century, the place remained culturally isolated from the rest of Egypt. Because of that, the Siwan people have developed their own unique customs. They also have their own language called Siwi, which is a Berber dialect. Vacationers come to the city to stroll and date palm plantations, to try tasty dates and olives, and to enjoy numerous hot water springs. One of the most popular is the Cleopatra's Bath. It is a natural spring that bubbles up from the ground. It is also a unique experience to explore the ancient fortress of Shali. In the middle of Siwa Oasis, there is a wall-fortified town that is built using mud brick and rock salt. A tour through these abandoned houses would be the highlight of your trip. Aside from that, there are also plenty of desert adventures that you can try, from dune buggy rides to sandboarding, which you will surely enjoy. Number 5. Red Sea One of the world's hottest and saltiest bodies of water. The Red Sea derived its name from the color changes observed in its waters. The water is actually an intense blue-green color. However, it is populated by extensive blooms of cyanobacteria called Trichodesmium erythraeum that turns into a reddish-brown color. The Red Sea is well known among scuba divers for its coral reefs and the vast amount of sea life. Here, you can witness several aquatic animals like colorful reef fish, turtles, nudibranchs, sharks, dolphins, rays, and also dugongs. For advanced divers, try going to the resort of Marsa Alam. It is the nearest base to dive in the southern part of Egypt. You can also visit the two main resort towns which are El Juna and Hurghada. El Juna is best for a luxurious holiday destination. It is a popular spot for diving chilling, and dolphin spotting. On the other hand, Hurghada was once a simple fishing village, but now has many high-end hotels. It is popular for scuba diving opportunities in other water sports like snorkeling, jet skiing, and windsurfing. 
However, if you prefer to appreciate the beauty of the Red Sea from above the water, don't worry because you can find several offers to go on glass bottom road trips. Number 6. Fjord Bay Fjord Bay is a wonderful natural bay just 15 kilometers south of Taba. It is a popular spot for many outdoor activities like swimming, boating, hiking, climbing, and diving. The aqua blue water contains dazzling coral reefs and is surrounded by rolling hills, making it a picturesque location that will stay in your mind even after the tour. Number 7. Luxor This world's largest open-air museum is located on the east bank of the Nile River. It is just a mid-sized city but it is best to stay for a couple of days to make the best out of this trip. Make sure to visit the Valley of Kings and Queens as Luxor is best known for this destination. It is home to over 60 carved underground tombs of ancient pharaohs, making it one of the most haunting places to visit in Egypt. Although many tombs can be found in this valley, only a few are open to tourists. Some tombs are already included if you buy an entrance ticket. However, if you wish to visit the final resting place of King Tutankhamun's mummy, prepare for an additional fee. Aside from that, get ready to be impressed at the Luxor and Karnak temples. The Luxor temple is located on the banks of Nile and is the star attraction in the city. It is one of the temples in Egypt that are best preserved. You can explore it at night and admire the beautiful illumination of the temple. On the other hand, the Karnak complex has four main parts. But the only one open to the public is the Temple of Amun, which is its main structure. Number 8. Islamic Cairo in the capital city of Egypt, you can find the area that has the densest concentration of historic architecture in the Islamic world. Make sure to get your camera ready as you venture into the vibrant alleyways of Cairo. Visit the Al-Azhar Mosque and Sultan Hassan Mosque and admire their intricate details. Other itineraries in the city are the Salah el-Din Citadel, Bab Zuela, Khan el-Khalili, Museum of Islamic Art, Al-Azhar Park, and Al Rifa'al Mosque. You need to allot a full day if you want to visit all of these. But for most tourists, just seeing the highlights is enough to bring them joy and amazement. Number 9. Saqqara You probably heard of the Pyramids of Giza, but they are not the only pyramids that Egypt can offer. Saqqara is a popular destination for the Old Kingdom Step Pyramid that shows the architectural and engineering knowledge of ancient Egyptians to be able to create a true pyramid shape. It is part of the UNESCO World Heritage Site and has a huge number of tourists for the myths and history of the place. You should also include the Red Pyramid and Bent Pyramid in your visit. Number 10. Pyramids of Giza and of course, your travel to Egypt won't be complete if you did not visit the Pyramids of Giza. It is undeniably the highlight of any Egypt trip. Typically, people refer to the three large pyramids located in the Giza complex when they say Pyramids of Giza. This includes the Great Pyramid, which is the biggest Egyptian pyramid containing the tomb of the 4th dynasty pharaoh Khufu, as well as its two neighboring pyramids, which are the Pyramid of Khafre and Menkara. It is built in the early 26th century BC, which makes it the oldest attraction among the seven wonders of the ancient world. After all the centuries that have passed, it is also the last surviving wonder among them. The best thing to do here is to go inside the pyramids and let yourself feel as if you step back in time. You can hire a private guide to tour you around. You can also visit the panoramic point where you can have the best view of the pyramids of Giza. From this spot, you would be able to see 6 out of 9 pyramids on the Giza Plateau. Lastly, don't miss a chance to take a picture with the Sphinx and go on a camel ride.